welcome to Arson Girl Plays. Please subscribe and ring the bell. That way you won't miss out on my next video. Hello guys, welcome to Arson Girl Plays. Today I'm checking out Farm Life. All right, so Farm Life is still in alpha and I have not been in here yet, but I am really, really curious to see how this goes. So it looks like maybe we, oh, we have five wheat seeds and a water watering can. Can we just come over here? Oh, look at that. The plots come out. Do we just wheat seeds, wheat seeds, wheat seeds, wheat seeds. Okay, we're just gonna do four wheat seeds for right now and then we can water. Oh, perfect. Once they are fully grown, harvest by clicking without any item in your hand. Okay, let's take that out of our hand. <gasps> Wait, what happened to these seeds? They just went down anyway, so we better water them. Look at that wheat growing. One of my favorite games is Farm Together. So this is kind of fun. Oh, and then you just click on them to harvest them. And you sell crops at the sell bin. Just hold them in your hand and click on the bin. Okay, so the bin's over here. Wheat. Sell. Ooh, I like this. Sell. Nice. Oh, we got more money. You're on your way to becoming a successful farmer. Use the store button on the left panel to shop for more seeds. All right, so that would be the shopping cart. I don't even know how much money I have. Oh, I have 55 gold. Okay, so let's buy all of the wheat seeds we can afford. So that's 11 because they harvest pretty quickly. We'll harvest those. Let's put our seeds down. All right, looks like you're out of water. Fill up your watering can at a pond or a river. Okay, so let's see if we can find a pond. Oh, it's an ax, okay, and a fishing rod and an enhanced watering can. Well, I don't have any Robux to spend right now and I'm on the hunt. <gasps> oh, can I pick these mushrooms? You can, ah. Uh. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna love this game. And there's like n other people here, but I don't see them anywhere. What's this? I don't know what that was. But while we're looking for a watering can, we'll just keep harvesting. It feels a little bit like Farm Together meets Stardew Valley. <laughs> What I wonder is if I'm going to run out of storage space, have to buy a bigger storage area. All right, I'm going to follow this path because I'm assuming I'm going to get to water soon. Oh, wait, he's cutting down trees. Oh, wait, I see this fishing elder. Oh, I was in the right way. This is, this is the maple forest. We were going the right way for the fishing, I think, which means water. Oh, yeah, I just didn't go far enough, but there's water. Oops, give me my mushroom. Thank you. Oh, this water is nice. And all right. So how do I fill it? I'm in the water. <laughs> Did that work? I don't know. It looks like Perhaps I have water because there's blue stuff in there. Now I just have to find my way back to my farm. Oh, he wants catfish. Okay, well, I don't have a fishing rod, so. That's to make some money before I can buy some stuff. Speaking of money, it looks like some of my wheat is ready to harvest. All right, why can't I water? Is the watering can empty? It looks like it has water in it, doesn't it? All right, well, let's harvest these and then we'll have to figure out how to put water in there. All right, we have 206 gold now, so I'm gonna go ahead and purchase some carrot seeds, some onion seeds, some pumpkin seeds. Oh, wait, I don't have enough money for the pumpkin seeds. How about onions, carrots, onions, carrots, onions, carrots. I'm gonna keep buying until I run out of money and that's gonna do it. What else can we buy in here? We can buy eggs. 
and stuff for our house. Oh my gosh, this is like Stardew Valley. I love it. If I get gold, enough gold, I can get an axe, a shovel, a sprinkler. Oh, this is so cool. Okay, let's go plant. I got it. So you have to hit watering can. You have to hit this button, watering can I, in or or I, in order to fill it up. Oh, wait. Can I drag that there? I can. Okay. I do have them, and I have no animals. Interesting. Can I plant the onions? Yes, I can. So I was. High quality carrot, 52, thank you. What's this one? Quality carrot for 40. And then regular carrots for 28. And how about a wild berry for 12? Nice, let's buy more. Super easy to buy stuff in here. Super easy to sell stuff in here. I was buying a ton of onion seeds, sold them, and now I have 2,300 gold. So I'm going to upgrade my tools here. I'm going to buy an axe. I'm going to buy a shovel. And I'm going to buy a fishing rod. And an, oh, I don't have enough. I was going to buy an iron watering can, but I don't have enough money. So one of these days I will. I'm wondering, though. If I, oh, I don't have enough money. Oh, I do have enough money for an egg. Let's go ahead and purchase an egg. Oh, oh, what happens here? I got a rare rabbit. Oh, fun, okay. Where's my rabbit? I wanna put him down. So spawn, oh, there's my rabbit. His name is Nettle, hi rabbit. Oh, he likes me, he's happy. I hope you won't run away if I leave him in here. Nettle is getting used to their new environment. I can ride him. I can rename him. I'm going to keep his name. I like him. And I can pick him up now. Can I hold him? No. I can just put him back in my back. Okay. Nettle, you can spawn. Hang out. And we're going to go to any pond or river and click the water source with your fishing rod. And we will start bringing home tasty fish. Let's just go to our little pond over here and see if there's any fish in it. Oh, now I'm fit. Wait, now I have a raw. I have, I have something. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Why is it going backwards? Do I? Oh, I got it. It doesn't just go by itself. Nice catch. Fish can be sold for money or sacrificed to the mysterious fishing elder shrine. It'll be worth it to see what the fishing elder can offer. And I just got a crab, so I'm pretty sure we saw that fishing elder earlier and he wanted something else. Let's go see how much this crab costs or is worth. 30 gold. Yes. All right. So we're going to do some fishing. Now let's go cut down some trees. Before we go cut down any trees, I just want to point out how beautiful my farm looks. So beautiful. All right, can I just cut down any tree? This is a basic tree. Every chop will get you one piece of wood. Nice job. Wood can be used for upgrades or sacrifice to the mysterious Lumberjack Elder Shrine. The Lumberjack Elder may reward you generously. All right, cool. But I think we should just do a little tour of the rest of this world. This is a gorgeous world. I think this game might be a little hidden gem that people just don't know about yet, but oh my gosh, I can see spending a lot of time in here for sure. This tree is too strong for my axe. Okay. Look at the waterfall. Oh, I see like a barn over here. Let's go explore. And there's like something up in the sky. Oh, this is somebody else's farm. Oh my gosh. Enderbow 98's farm. Look at his crops. Dang. Got some chicken over here. Some eggs. Ooh, I need some chickens to lay some eggs. He's got a little barn, a carrot feeder. Oh, this is goals right here. 
There's not a whole lot of players on this world, and I kind of like it. It's very peaceful. And I think this is where I'm going to end this video. I hope you enjoyed touring this world and learning how to farm alongside me. I think I'm going to do this more often. So if you guys like this, give me a thumbs up. Let me know you watched. And of course, if you want to see more of it on my channel, you'll want to make sure you subscribe and then ring the bell because once you do that, that'll let YouTube know you would like notify, notified when I post something new on the channel. And that will be happening fairly frequently. So you will not want to miss out on that. And I will see you guys again real soon. Until then, bye.